and welcome to Blockland Help. In these videos I will be showing you how to do stuff in Blockland like events and some building techniques. If you have any suggestions of what to make a video of, leave a comment below or fill the form out on my channel or on my website. Today I'm going to be teaching you how about um, advanced variable, variable links with multiple if statements. Now this is uh, pretty advanced stuff that I'm getting into right now. So if you've just started to learn VCE this is um, not really recommended. I would check out I would check out my other videos first um, so you can get a basic understanding of VCE so uh, and just uh, get your way up to this with uh, all my other videos so um, today we're going to be making a store with um, var variable uh, oh, what's it called variable links and multiple if statements there we go uh, basically, we're going to click this brick, and it's going to give us options of which kind of items we want of, up in the chat menu here. And we're going to click it, and it's going to spawn uh, here. But the thing is, we're going to be needing some cash, which I guess, th which this brick will be giving us, giving to us. Um, so we're going to be actually let's start with this one on activate client mod variable gold add just add five gold whenever we click that brick okay um event okay now we're gonna start here on activate client uh chat message very important variable links only work in chat messages so um s uh, item list activate client chat message, then we're going to add a sword, we're going to do, be doing two items, three items is very, is um, a lot more events, and I don't really think that I have much time for that, well, I'm, I'm sure I do, but it's uh, not necessary to show you this, so variable, there, sword, just going to be doing sword and a bow, uh, we're just going to name this variable sword, sward, <laughs> sword, one okay and then activate client chat message bow bow one um okay so that was simple right well now we get into the more advanced area of this it's going to take some brain power uh okay so on very update client if variable Ward greater than or equal to one on variable true. We're just gonna start with this. Um, let's see. Uh, client if variable gold greater than or equal to. Uh, we're just gonna have the sword be ten gold and the bow be five gold. So ten. So it's going to check if the variable that is updated was the sword, and it's going to check if we have enough gold. And let's see, variable false. If variable, this is going to seem a bit disorganized right now, because uh, they are going to be pretty disorganized. Uh, let's see, but. Um, where am I? Okay, uh, hold on. <laughs> I'm very confused. Okay, on variable true, clients if variable, actually, um, yes, okay, okay, it's all good. Equal to, if you're dealing with money, you always want to do monies and stores, you're always going to do greater than equal to so if a player has more than enough money they can still do that so okay so here if the variable sword we're gonna activate events uh, let's see four through five four five and this we're gonna activate five five no six 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 okay and then variable true self 
spawn item. Oh, let's see here. Sword. Sword. Variable true. Client. Mod variable of gold. Subtract 10. Okay. So, if they have enough gold, they're going to lose their gold, and somebody just connected to my server because I have to have it online. Okay, so, um, let's see, on variable false, right, yes, that's where I'm at, um, variable false, client, uh, chat message, you need more gold, you have Gold. Okay, so uh, okay, so um, that's going to tell you how much gold you have. So here, so we're here, and that's going to activate event seven and not seven through nine. And let's see here on variable true self spawn. Um, I'm sorry, this is, okay, spawn item, uh, bow, yeah, actually, it's just, hold on, self, set item, oops, <laughs> that was supposed to be spawn item, sword, and we're just going to have this velocity be 5. So it goes up a little bit and it's not stuck in the brick. Okay, uh, uh, variable true, uh, clients, mod variable gold, subtract 5, variable false, clients, uh, chat message, you need more gold, you have Okay, so that is that, so we're going to be doing 10 through 12, 10 through 12, and that should basically, that should do it, actually no, it shouldn't, uh, on variable updates, clients, mod variables, ward, this is very, very, very important. If you want people to be using this this store more than once, you're going to be wanting to do this. Uh, you have to do this for every single weapon variable or varilink variable you have set up here. You're going to be wanting to set it to one and set the delay to 33 milliseconds there. So that is the events that you're going to need. So right now, click on the. Oh, wait a second. What the. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Silly me. That's not ver. That's varilink. Oops. Let's see, link. Okay. I don't really care about him listening to Base Hunter. Okay, so, clicked on this, and we're going to be wanting to get a sword. Okay. Ah, uh, do we want a bow? I have no gold. Oh, that's very depressing. So now I have five gold. Click on this. I need a bow. We have a bow. Hooray! Okay, now we're gonna want to get let's see here. I have five gold right now. Ah, I need five more gold. Sword. Hooray! Worked first try. <laughs> uh, last time I tried to do this, I have made a store like this twice. First time was um, took a bit longer because it was the first time and I did it all by myself and the second time I was helping another guy do it and there was a bunch of issues because he was very new to VCE so uh, if goes to but um, 
if you're new to VCE, this isn't really the best uh, thing you should start out with. You should basically just start out with uh, click a, if you, when you click a brick and you have enough variables, then you get the item nots, var links, and then multiple if statements and everything like that. That's very complicated unless you can actually unless you understand it very well. Uh, just because you do for some reason, um, then feel free to. Um, I can't really think of any other guides to make right now, so if you have any suggestions of guides, please uh, tell me, because I don't really know anything to make. So, I will see you next video about whatever it's going to be about. So, see you later.